I didn't watch that much soccer, I yeah. have to admit, in the past. But you start watching a lot of it, you learn new things. One of my favorite things are the goal celebrations. Have you seen those? Some of them, some of the teams work out these really elaborate goal celebrations. Here's a famous one from a team in Iceland. Check it out. That was pretty uh, elaborate, but guess what? That is nothing compared to this epic celebration from a match yesterday. Check this out. Goal! Here comes the celebration. They're celebrating in midfield, and they are, uh, they're sitting down. It looks like he's miming a microphone, and it uh, looks like he's pretending that he's a stand-up comedian, and he's doing his stand-up. Looks like he's going over pretty well with the crowd, doing some crowd work. Uh, they're loving his material, and here comes another player pretending to be a cocktail waitress, miming the cocktails. I have to get two cocktails. But, okay, what are they doing now? It looks like uh, playing some scene. Oh, it's a few good men. Here he comes. You can't handle the truth. Great scene. Okay, oh, it's the 7-10 split. And he missed it. He missed it. it looks like uh, the price is right. And they've gotten an, an opposing player to pretend he's a refrigerator. To open the refrigerator to show off the crisper, and it looks like it's time for him to spin. Oh yeah, spin the giant clickety clackety wheel. Whew. Great space work. Here comes the referee. This has been a really long celebration. He doesn't know what to do about it. He's calling up to the booth. He, they're not giving him any. Oh, he looks like he won the Price Is Right. He won, and now they're celebrating his Price Is Right win with another celebration. What's this? It looks like. Oh, I know. It's Ned Stark from Game of Thrones. Poor guy. And there's the angry blogger in the foreground. What commitment. <laughs>